Hello and thank you for tuning back in. Uh, this today and in fact for this week, huge recommendation, Fitness in Dubai, the 2018 uh, CrossFit event that took place last year, December, 10 events over four days. Very, very impressive documentary. This is the leading into the fittest, which I spoke about in a previous video along with um, Color from Outer Space, basically. Um, this um, was like the stopping point before your qualifier into the CrossFit Games of last year, 2019, um, and also does impact the way that a lot of the events are kind of set up for how you can enter into future uh, CrossFit uh, Games and regionals and things. So they do hint at that in this, which is fantastic. So this is a really good segue into prepping you for watching that particular documentary. This one is just 60 minutes, it's perfect. Uh, really good, very inspiring. Uh, the Buttery Brothers, um, Gravitas Pictures, Netflix the distributor, fantastic all around. Production value is excellent. It looks gorgeous. You see some really beautiful scenic um, areas of Dubai itself. Obviously, you get to hear the athletes and their stories. And the mental and the physical and the passion and the just sheer enthusiasm they all have for competing in these events is absolutely phenomenal. To see people like Samantha Briggs, Laura Holven and uh, Matt Fraser as always um, at full tour de force here. And at, right now at the moment, obviously, it being Easter time or post-Easter sorry, post -Easter time now, I should say, sorry. Uh, we're obviously still in April. It's still not quite warm, so to watch something like this, which actually took place... Um, almost two years ago now, that sort of December time, to see the heat is absolutely phenomenal. I felt a bit warmer watching it, which was great. Um, I can't say enough good things about this. It will inspire you. It will want you to keep training at home at these times of uncertainty. Um, get outside, do some jogging. It's absolutely fantastic. Such a good, entertaining watch. And just to hear um, the stories as well about how athletes competing who some are working some are not working so just to get into this event allows you obviously to win as always there is obviously prize money but then to hear them actually say that they're simply doing it to use this money then compete into further events even more inspiring and encouraging to hear that you know there are outlets for these athletes as crossfitters and that there is opportunity and that they're creating and establishing more stars and more entries now into the event to make it a bigger and broader appeal it's absolutely fantastic it's just so well shot as well buttery brothers do not let down at any point and just the editing alone and the pacing of it you feel like you're in the events with them and that is something to behold itself it's just really phenomenal to watch it all the way through and it's they are like look they are basically essentially documentary films but they feel like more like movies they're just so impactful these crossfit films and there have been several of them now, and I really, really can't wholly recommend this one enough. Check it out. It's on Netflix now, available from today. Um, and also, do go on then to watch The Fittest, which is available on streaming and video on demand platforms and services. It's just absolutely fantastic. It doesn't get any better than this. Fittest in Dubai, check it out. Um, you can't go wrong. A really great watch. Um, enjoy it. Talk about it. Share I'd um, like to hear your thoughts and opinions on the CrossFit Games and if you watch them on a regular basis or if you've seen a lot of the documentary films as well, um, please share your thoughts and opinions down below. Please like the video if you do with a thumbs up and I'd love to hear more constructive feedback from all of you out there. Well, stay safe and hope to hear from you all very soon. More videos coming up and I'd like to hear some recommendations from you guys as well. What have you been watching on Netflix or any of the other services that are available right now? And as always, please stay safe. Thank you so much. Take care for now. Bye.